Hello, and welcome to Pokemon Red Nuzlocke. In the last episode, we dealt with Erica's people, and they had the cheapest strategy ever. In this episode, we're going to be taking on the leader, Erica. And who knows, she may be easier than the rest of the people in this gym. Anyways, let's go fight her. Hello, lovely weather, isn't it? It's so pleasant. Oh dear, I must have dozed off. Welcome. My name is Erica. I am the leader of Celadon Gym. I teach the art of flower arranging. So, let me get this straight. You're, you want women's rights. You want equality in this world. And you're teaching girls how to flower arrange? Irony. My Pokemon are of the grass type. But, oh, I'm sorry. I had no idea that you wished to, to, blah, blah, to challenge me. Very well, but I shall not lose. You're a girl, you're gonna lose. No way, that's against what this gym is for. Oh well. And here's Erica. She has a floating Pokeball for some reason. She sends out Victory Bell. In, it's a po grass poison type that knows Wrap, Poison Powder, Sleep Powder, and Razor Leaf. William is level 27. He knows Psybeam now, so let's try it out. Let's see how much it does. Um, understand that Victory Bell has a lot of HP, so this is... Wow. Oh, nice! It's confused. Let's see if it hits itself. Nope. And it used Razor Leaf. That's not too bad. Oh wow, critical hit. Well, at least we're gonna take care of it. it. Didn't poison us or anything. I was scared it would, or use rap or something. Something annoying like that, but it didn't. I'm about to use Tangela. Um Yeah, let's switch. Um Let's go Rossetti. You're probably wondering why would I use Rossetti? Tangela is just a grass type. So Will wouldn't be that good. It only knows Bind and Constrict, so it's really not that threatening of a Pokemon. I mean, I guess it is if you're that scared of it, but it's not. Oh wow, it didn't do a lot of damage. I know it wouldn't, usually, but it could be useful sometimes. Let's try Scratch. The point is I just want to get rid of it as fast as possible, and oh my god. Well, this is not getting rid of it as fast as possible. And now it's going to Constrict, or Bind, and... Er, er, er. I mean, there's not a lot I can do. Constrict is kind of like a one-turn thing, so it's not as bad as just using Bind or Wrap over and over. So, yeah. But anyways, after this gym, we'll be uh, heading towards, uh, well, the Pokemon Tower. Uh, but as you can see, she's not as difficult as the rest of the people in her gym. Erica seems to be quite the pushover in this game. I mean, I guess. I haven't used one item. I. I've decided I won't use any items during this gym. No, wait. <laughs> I've decided I'm only gonna use two, so... Yeah, just so you know. But Vileplume is a grass poison. It knows Poison Powder, Mega Drain, Sleep Powder, and Petal Dance. Um, it's not that bad of a Pokemon. It's really not difficult to beat. Uh, it will take two turns to defeat, but it won't kill us within the time- Whoa! Okay? It won't take two turns to beat. It'll take one turn. And we just... Wow, that was surprising. Williams level 28. Wow, this is impressive. So we beat Erica. That was quick. Oh, I can see defeat. You are remarkably strong. I must confer you the Rainbow Badge. And we get money. Yay. The Rainbow Badge will make Pokemon up to level 50 obey. It also allows Pokemon to use strength in and out of battle. Please also take this with you. And we get TM21. Alright, sweet. And we get Mega Drain. Which is, you know, it's kind of like absorb but stronger. So let's uh let's get out of here. Um now since we have cut, I'm going to go back to Route 8 and go into that patch of grass that has, you know, all that all that good stuff. Uh remember? That we couldn't go to before because I didn't have cut. Yeah. We're gonna try to get a Pokemon from there. It'll either be an Onish or a Growlithe, so we'll see. Um so yeah, let's go. We will still come back to Celadon City eventually. Maybe for nostalgia. But I don't know. It's really not that hard of a place, if you think about it. And wow, we've only spent four minutes? That was the quickest gym battle ever! I think. Was it? Meh. But yeah. Imagine if that was our Betty. Or, <laughs> Lily. Can't get that out of my mind. Alright, we'll get Tank also, um... 
in in Lavender. Because that's where we're going for the Pokemon Tower. Now that we have the Silscope, we can see what ghosts are. And that means we can catch a ghost Pokemon. Or Cubone. Yeah, there were only three ghost Pokemon in the first games. That's not good. Alright. So I already faced all the trainers here, but let's go over there. We Not item. Slave, use cut. And let's switch out of Will and go into Monkey. Let's see what we catch. And, oh wow, first thing, and it's gonna be a... Uh, Growlithe, yes! I love Growlithe. They're not that good early on, but they can get sweet later. So let's use Scratch and hope we don't kill it, even though you're 10 high levels higher. And... You little bitch! Like... Oh shit, no, 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 no. Fuck! Ugh. <sighs> well... Nope. That, that wasn't happening. What? I didn't face a trainer. We must look silly standing here like this. Oh, you've got to be kidding me. Ugh. That's irritating. That is irritating. Just kill it, monkey. Oh my god. I, I can't believe that. Are you kidding me? It, it used roar and we have to leave? Ugh. That is such bullcrap. Like, actually, girlfriend, I'm going to choke a baby. Oh! But that's so not fair. Like, really? What the hell? Uh, it, why do things like that have to work? Like, like, why can't Roar and Whirlwind just bring out another Pokemon? Why do they have to make us run away? That's not fair. I wanted that Growlithe. And now Monkey's at level 27. whoop de frickin' do Focus energy? Oh, we better learn that. That's an important move to know. Leer. We haven't even used Leer, like, in forever. Yeah, he learned something! You know what I learned? That I hate everything. A Meowth. Oh no. So scary. You know what's almost as scary? Losing a Growlithe. I hate that so much. <laughs> like, you have no idea. I wanted Growlithe so bad, and now I can have it. <laughs> it's really not that big of a deal. I mean, we might not get another chance to catch a Growlithe, but... Whatever. I mean, we have enough. And fire types aren't really necessary, because all ice types are kind of like... are kind of just... Um... How do I put it? Ice types are kind of usually... Who are the ice types? There's Lapras, and... Um... Jinx? But yeah, they're really not that... You, fire types aren't the best Pokemon to have. I mean, I guess against Erica they are, and then... I don't know if there's any other use. Probably not. Look what you did! Shut up! Because of you, I lost everything. Not actually, but you know. I still blame you. It was your fault in some ways. <sighs> Alright, let's just heal up and get Tank. I was really hoping we wouldn't have to just, like... Just... Get tank. I hope we could get a Growlithe, but that wasn't gonna happen. So whatever. I guess that's cool. I guess whatever. I don't need to be happy that you know. I'm happy with who I am and what I have. And since we don't need slave anymore, um, we might use slave later, but we're not gonna right now. So let's go back, tank. All right, let's go. Da -na 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 -na. And I don't want to catch anything on the first few floors. Um, I would definitely... Um, now you can see the Pokemon info on the right. It's only red and blue because the yellow stuff I didn't really care too much about. But, yeah. It's confusing, but it's by floor. Like, the first one's level 3, which is what we're on. And then... Um... 
and then it goes level like four through six, and then it's seven. That's how most of them go. But anyways, let's try to get up there without running into anything. That's why I use a super repel, because on the top floor, you have the best chance of getting a haunter, and that's kind of what I want. I might not use it, but it's better than just a ghastly. If I wanted a Cubone, I wouldn't have Rossetti with me. But personally, I like Rossetti better than Cubones. Look at all the- you know, in retrospect, you could have just gone to Celadon and not faced anyone in here. Um, I did because they were closer to the level we are at. We were at, so, you know. Plus, yeah. Why not? Just saves us time later in the game, I guess. <laughs> in the game! Get it? Ha ha ha! Alright, here we are. Be gone, intruders! Ooh, I'm a ghost! And let's see, what is this? It's ghost, and the silph scope unveiled the ghost identity, which is a... Marowak! I know, weird, right? So, it's it may be ghost, but it's weak to water and grass and all that, because it's a ground type. And wow, we did a lot. Um, it's not- you can't catch Marowaks, so I don't even try. Um, but yeah. It's not really that difficult to beat, unless you really don't have anything good against it. The ghost was the restless soul of Cubone's mother. The mother's soul was calmed. It departed to the afterlife. A lot of death in this game. But anyways, up here... What? Rocket? How? Oh my, this is, uh, surprising! But let's just send out Sparky. What do you want? Why are you here? Why am I here? The great mysteries of life. We'll never know them truly. So let's just let's face Zubit. Zubit! There we go, Zubat, Zubat, dude, dude, Zubat. I don't know why I'm talking like that. <laughs> I'm so silly. Oh bite. You know, I keep thinking it's gonna get paralyzed from like the ability, but then I realize there are no abilities in the first two generations. <laughs> it's really hard to go from like the new the newer generations to the old ones, because there's so many differences. But, you know, that's what makes it fun. The differences and everything that's changing. Now he sends out Zubat. Oh yeah, guys, we're halfway done with this game already. I mean, really, only 33 episodes and we've already beaten Erica. Next next thing you'll know, we, we'll be facing Koga, then Sabrina, then Blaine, and then... Well, I'm not going to spoil who the 7th, 8th one is. And then... Glurp and Norby! Gosh, I hate Glurp and Norby. I hate him so much. He, have you ever faced Glorp and Orby? He's so cheap. Like, all the time. All he does is Glorping and Lorping with his Glorperific Pokemon. I'm not gonna tell you what it is, you'll figure it out. And don't you dare look online and search who is the 8th Gym Leader of Kanto, because I won't ever respect me again. Oh wow, we did nothing. Is it just me or does that Golbat look like it's like, high or something? I'm a gold bat. Why would it use two screeches in a row? That seems horribly ineffective. Psybeam! Out of all the Pokemon we have, I think the most effective would be Tank and William. They seem the strongest at this point. But we beat the rocket. I give up. I'm not going to forget this. And he leaves? Well, okay. Um, you know what? I would continue, but I think we've done enough. I know we haven't done that much, but we're in Pokemon Tower, and we'll continue next episode. So next time on Pokemon Red Nuzlocke, we will continue through Pokemon Tower. I haven't said that in a while. And we'll find out exactly what is the point of all this. And then, who knows what will happen? I do, but you don't. See you guys next time.